Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. I am Sermit Sidi from Leeds Mathematics. Topic which I'm going to discuss today is Julia Nitrate. What's Julia Nitrate? Let's talk about that. It has a destructive power like better known ammonium nitrate explosive. Julia Nitrate is produced in one step by reaction of urea with nitric acid. This is an exothermic reaction, so steps must be taken to control the temperature. Urea nitrate explosions must be initiated by blasting caps. The compound is favored by many amateur explosive enthusiasts as a principal explosive for use in larger charges. In this role, it acts as a substitute for ammonium nitrate-based explosives. This is due to the ease of acquiring the materials necessary to synthesize it and its greater sensitivity to initiation compared to ammonium nitrate-based explosives. Medium nitrate is explosive when left in dry state, wetting reduces possibility of explosion. It may explode under prolonged exposure to heat or fire. Even when wet, it reacts with strong oxidizer such as perchlorates and hypochlorite. With hypochlorite, it forms a compound nitrogen trichloride, which explodes spontaneously in air, must be stored in a cool, ventilated place, away from acute fire hazards and easily oxidized materials. They are powerful oxidizing agents, which may cause violent reactions with reducing materials. Nitrates should be protected carefully in storage, decomposition is catalyzed by the presence of heavy metals such as lead or iron in trace amounts. Environmental hazards caused by urea nitrate. Talking about the environmental hazards, urea nitrate is a fertilizer based high explosive that has been used in improvised explosive devices in many countries like Iran, Iraq. It was used as well in 1993 World Trade Center bombing. It should not be confused with nitrogenia. Both are completely different, so both terms should not be confused together. This should be kept in mind. Now coming to the uses of urea nitrate, Urea nitrate is a dynamite of carbonic acid, water soluble, white crystalline compound, which has weight molecular of 60.06 and a melting point of 132.7 degree and 46.6% and control. The properties that make it fertilize of choice are highest and content 46 percent therefore lesser amount of it are needed to be applied which results in reducing transportation costs its non-popular nature makes it ideal for foundry application and mixing it with other fertilizers materials to make it different and take it brand it can be mixed with pesticides therefore Permits application for small amount of them along with pesticides at no additional cost and when mixed with some herbicides, it has some really beneficial effects. Urea it absorbs moisture from the air when relative humidity is 72 degrees, is 72 percent, or more than 30 degrees centigrade. Thank you very much. Namaste, Namaste.